is a starter off of a 1993 Johnson 200 horsepower Ocean Runner outboard that quit working on me. It wouldn't, uh, it runs, the motor runs, the starter motor runs, but, and the um, starter gear engages in the flywheel just fine but it just sits there the shaft the, the motor spins and this is in the flywheel but it does not turn the starter gear in the flywheel it just sits there and goes Meow! and I thought well every normal Bendix style starter I've ever seen had a, I think they call it a sprag gear in this drive gear that will only let it spin one way. It'll, it'll engage it and spin the flywheel and then when the flywheel kicks up and it starts running this will spin freely and just drop back down. Well, I looked at this thing and I took it apart and it it was all greasy and messed up and it looked to me like it had come apart. I thought, well, that's some kind of rubber joint, like a shock absorber. When it engages to kind of not jam the flywheel and the engine so hard or something. <laughs> but, and I looked all over the internet and they show the picture of these like in one piece. And it never dawned on me. I thought, well, this thing's just melted and fallen apart. And I just had an epiphany that I think maybe it's two pieces, supposed to be two pieces, and it just got all oiled up and couldn't grip. Thinking maybe as the Bendix gear or Bendix spiral spins up and jams jams this nut down into the flywheel or actually it's sitting upside down like this into the flywheel that the friction and the pressure of that Bendix spiral is supposed to engage that rubber and make it spin I don't think it's burnout at all. I think it's a friction clutch instead of a sprag gear clutch. So I went down and tried to buy the part and everything. They went $165 just for that little part there. And I said, no, no, I, I can't do that. I think you can get like a whole starter on Amazon, a Chinese one, including everything for like $65 so anyway I was getting ready to do that and I just kept looking at that thing and the closer I looked at it the less it looked like it was burned up it looked like it was made that way and I said how in the hell and then it dawned on me that I had been greasing that thing the gear and it probably got grease down in there so if that's true, I'm, I'm going to clean it up really good with some degreaser there. Put it all back together in there and see if it works. And we'll get back to you and let you know. Here's the motor. I got it back on and yes, it works perfectly. I just had too much grease on it. Listen.